hello guys so welcome to this video in this video we we see how you can handle basic cost management of aws account and in previous video we created a aws account in free tire and then we secure our aws account after that uh, in this video we will set up the aws budget so before we understand the aws budget we need to understand uh, what aws provided in free tire so i just open this link which all details are mentioned about the aws free tire i will provide this link in description you can go and just check out that so if you scroll down and check this one like a type of offers which aws provided so these are three types like free trial this is the short term free trial offered start from the date you active the particular service and second one is like a 12 months free so it is like some services which is 12 months free for that and some services like aws provided which is always free so if you scroll down and there are all services are present here and you can check like which service is free for how much time so if you take an example like this one amazon ec2 instance so 750 hours per month is free and if you take the second example like amazon s3 so 5gb we can upload the 5g data on s3 uh, after that we need to pay to aws uh, so this page give you overview of all the different free services of all the aws product so highly recommended uh, so highly recommended look out this page to understand the aws free tire services which aws provided so now we come back to our question why we need to set up a budget in our aws account before we need to understand the budgets so budgets are really effective way which allows you to monitor your spend and configure alerts as you approach certain percentage of desired spends and it is a really good service to manage the cost so there are so many services available in aws for free and for some limited uses so take example like you launch some one ec2 instance or store some data in s3 and at some certain time free users exceed and aws start charging you for all that services which you are using so if you did not set up the budget then you can get shocking wheel over a night and uh, if you if you ever set up the budget in your AWS account, like example ten dollars per month, if your budget reached at that ten dollars, AWS will notify you about your budget. So that is a good thing. We can uh, when we get the notification, you, you can look at your AWS account and you can take uh, some action. So okay, we understand the AWS budget. Now we need to set up this budget in this account. So we are setting the budget in our root account and make sure we are logged in as a account root user. So if these are things are good, then we need to go to account and we need to go to and not just developer username and here we can see billing dashboard just click on that and you will land it to this uh, aws billing dashboard where here you can see all your spend which you used here you can see all your spends uh, which you uh, used your services and these are the all option you can explore this and here is the our data is not visible because we are create this is newly created aws account uh, so now we need to go to bills and here you can see month by month billing and there is a new account so there is no months are there so you can see month by month uh, your billing and invoice then we need to go to billings reference and uh, so after clicking on billing reference you can see the all these options like uh, billing reference cost management reference so uh, we need to check 
uh, mark this one uh, see pdv of invoice by email so mark this box uh, after mark this box we you will receive the billing invoice by every month so this is important for everyone to like uh, we need to check this one is this is all marked or not and second option is like cost management so free tire uses alerts so this is also important we need to check mark this one also like when we we will receive the uh, free tire uses alerts so we need to enter the email for that so i'm entering my email address and you will enter your email address and third one is like a receive billing alerts so we need to that also feature so you will get the alerts like uh, billing alerts so please check that the all these three or things are marked and just click on save reference so after clicking on the save reference these all saved now just go to budget now we will need to set up the budget so for creating a budget we need to click on this create budget and you can see uh, choose your budget type and the uh, we are seeing two options like a use template or customize so we are using only simple template next one is like a, a four options which is like a zero spend budget monthly cost budget and daily saving plans daily reservation so we are using only upper two ones so first we created a zero spend budget which means like creating a budget that notifies you once your limit exceeds aws free tire limits so we are currently using a free tire aws account so when we whenever we exceed this free tire limits we will get notification from aws so next one is like monthly cost budget so this so this means like a creating monthly budget that notifies you when if you exceed or for costed to exceed the budget amount so this we already understand like uh, when we we set up one uh, amount and if we, if we exceed that amount aws will uh, notify you that your uh, budget is exceed so we can take a action further so first one we created a zero spend budget so choosing the zero spend budget and we need to give a budget name so the aw is already suggested so i am keeping this one and then next we need to give a email address where we get the notification so i am giving my email address you can give yours and now we need to create a budget click on creating a budget so it will take some time or now you can see the our budget is created first budget is created where budget is one dollar now next one we need to click on create budget monthly cost budget second option here we put as five dollar so whenever we reached five dollar aws will notify me so i am entering my address now we need to create this and you can see like you will be notified when your actual spend is 80 percent and your actual spend is 107 if you forget to see it so you will get two times notification just click on create budget so you can see we created two budgets so first one is like a monthly spend second one is for free tire uses so that's all we need to do in our newly created aws account so now in next video we will see how we manage multiple accounts in single account so for that please subscribe our channel and thank you for watching this video